All right, send me back. That's why people buy at Old Navy full price. <gasps> I knew it. Yo, wait, what's this over here? What is that? What is that flag? Is that the the star base that's still flagged? It's kind of weird. Go to the Pokemon Center, heal me up. Let's do a little training. Let's do a little bit of training first. This is our team. This is this is the team that we're taking into the Elite Four. So let's uh, let's get them all in fighting form. I mean, obviously this guy, Tort and Dollop, both have a long way to go. Little Dripper's a little bit behind as well. I'm gonna make you the lead Pokemon, and you're gonna do some work. You're gonna get out here, and you're gonna do some work. Let's go. Uh, okay, that's not gonna end well for you. <laughs> Just kidding. Instead, it's a pure fighting type, right? So what if I send out a uh, charcuterie? I, I'm getting surrounded by these guys. These monkeys are getting real angry at me. That's got to move around a little bit. Here we go. We'll just move around a little bit. It's fine. Keep going. Keep it going. Charcuterie is kind of like... Kind of taking down everybody, isn't he? Damn. Charcuterie got moves. I love it. Have some nice battles. <gasps> I am having some pretty nice battles. So let's see. I think what I want is for... For us to go into the Elite Four. In most games, you gotta be... Is that a Dreepy over there? Hello. Or a uh, Dra Dragapult, I think is his name. Dreepy is the little guys, right? In most games, Elite Four is... Hello? Why, why are you sad over there? What happens when you lose in Pokemon? Uh, usually you just, like, black out and you land in a, uh, in a Pokemon Center. Yeah, like Dogfish said. And you lose some money. But money is, like, no, no issue in this game anyway, so it's like, whatever. <laughs> um, what was I gonna say? In most games, the Elite Four, you want to be, like, in your mid-60s to take them on. So we're going to do a little bit of training and get our team up to the mid-60s. Mostly, I'm kind of... Oh, frick. Stop chasing me. Stop chasing me, though! Can you take this guy on, please? Please fight him, thank you. It's legal to beat someone up and take their money in this game? Yeah, in fact, it's encouraged. Pretty sure it's encouraged. Let's heal you up a little bit. Let's take this guy on. Pro Wrestling. If he says pro wrestling, that means he's probably going to send out a fighting type. And if I'm going to take on a fighting type, I'm thinking... Ah! Oh, thank you. For the poop and the cheese, Dango. You spoil me. <laughs> uh, let's send Dogfish out to the front. Dogfish hasn't had a lot of action yet. You youngins call that flashy sport pro wrestling rights popular among your set these days? What, what are you implying? Anna Maria the student. All right. Hang on. I think Anna Maria might be the oldest student we've seen so far. She literally has graying hair. How are you still a student? She got held back a lot. <laughs> wow. She was an accountant until 65 and decided to take up Pokemon battling in retirement. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> oh, you know what? How much damage does Muddy Water do? 90. Oof. Oof. Okay. Get you with some Muddy Water then. You're never told you're never too old to finish an education. Yeah. An adult learner. Cringe. <laughs> What's up, Bear? How you doing today? Ooh, actually. Yeah, we'll survive. Check that Dogfish is over here uh, being a badass. He's just a tiny little fish man. Look at him go. <laughs> Let's see if Anna, Mar Anna Maria's actually got some decent uh, Pokemon on her team, too. Hello. Allop is leveling up. Bronzong's coming out next. Well, we all know who that's going to go up against. 
actually steal psychic, right? Let's send out chives. Scrunkly little sushi. I know Dogfish is just a scrungly little sushi man, and now I really want sushi. Who's gonna take me out for sushi? How many people take me out for sushi? I want to take out for sushi. I can't I can't justify going out for sushi because I have like so many leftovers from Thanksgiving in the fridge. But like I do want that sushi though. I'll get sushi at MFF. <gasps> Brint! I so want to get sushi at MFF. Hell yeah. We'll do sushi and sake. Doing good playing this pirate game you found on Game Pass? I think Rare made it. Oh, Banjo Kazooie. Yeah, it's a good one. It's a good game. Good game, solid game. But actually, Bear, are you are you Sea of Thievesing? Is this the first time you played Sea of Thieves? No. I feel like I've played Sea of Thieves with you before, right? Or am I misremembering? I might be misremembering. You know, pro Pokemon battles. Yeah, obviously. Oh, I just watched. Yo! Well, in that case, we got to get together for some um, for some Sea of Thievesing then. I would love to uh, hang out with you sometime and play some Sea of Thieves. Oh no, Dogfish is sad. Okay, uh, Dogfish is sleepy now. This hair cross needs to get away from my face. There he goes. Okay, cool. I have some seed. I've seed some thieves. Oh my gosh. I, Dango, you out here seeding thieves? Wow. Wow. Unfreaking believable. <laughs> uh, hey, uh, Bear, how do you like it so far? Are you are you sailing solo right now? Don't go with me on a Disney cruise, but you're going to rickety pirate boat and pursue the life of high stakes cutthroat criminally? I mean, who wouldn't? Charcuterie is sad! What the hell? Just started. Need to get a capture card soon, though? <gasps> Yo. Tomes is going to be getting a capture card? Honestly, when I first started uh, Sea of Thieves, it was a little jarring, I guess is the way I would put it. It's a little bit, uh, a little bit confusing, a little bit hard to understand. Uh-oh. All right, he's sad. How about, how about against a Scyther? Can you fight a Scyther, maybe? Oh, there you go. No, don't chase me. Don't you chase me. There we go. Fight these, fight these guys. No, he's tired. Damn it. Everyone's getting all sleepy. Uh, let's send out Tort. Torta, perhaps. EVP is so weird. It's a little weird. It's a little hard, right? Just run away. I would never, I would never run away. Never surrender. Except for when they get sleepy and then I have to surrender. Get in there. Come on, get in there. You can do it. My Pokemans are sleepy. Getting a decent amount of XP out here, though. So that's pretty nice. I should probably work on their moveset, too. I'm not sure how much more they're going to learn by leveling up. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Hey, uh, can you take this guy on? Thank you, thank you. Live another day. I mean, the Pokemon Center is right there. I could just, like, you know, retreat back to the Pokemon Center as needed. She's a little slow, isn't she? Tort needs to get some pep in her step. There we go, that's better. What is your type matchup that's beating these guys so bad, by the way? It's kind of weirding me out a little bit. I'll just, I'll, I'll, you know what? I'll just let her go. She's, she's doing great. So I'm trying to think of like the best way that we can get our team into like the mid 60s. What the hell is that? Oh, it's a cricket tot. Got it. I'm thinking this auto battle is probably our best bet. I think uh, also um, our little, I forget his name, Dollop? I think Dollop is the one who's furthest behind right now. He's got a long way to go. How level is he? He's level 40. Basically, everybody... We, we are 10 levels away from where we need to be. So it's going to take a little bit of grinding. We learn moves at 59. Depends on the Pokemon. Since some of them are uh, 57. Some are 54. Some are 51. We learn moves until 59. Oh, okay, so by the time I hit 59, I can pretty safely assume that they will have learned everything they're going to learn, right? 
That seems reasonable. Hmm. I'm trying to think of what my threat is going to be for held items. What do I have in my bags? Let's strategize a little bit, shall we? So these are my held items. Reduces weight. Longer weather. Delbell, I think, is going to go on our tankiest Pokemon. Never melt ice. Well, that probably should go with Do uh, with um, Little Dripper, right? No, no, don't use it. Don't use it. Just give it to you. Shell Bell is very nice. So is Leftovers. Let's give sh uh, Leftovers to someone who has a lot of health. I'm thinking maybe Dogfish will hold that one. And a big attacker, I think Shell Bell is going to go on Charcuterie. Ice Stone, Leaf Stone, Fire Stone. None of these are held items, though. Do I really not have any held items? Hmm, leftovers. Exactly. I knew Dogfish would appreciate. I guarantee they won't have any more moves to learn by the time they get to 59. Oh, perfect. Toads, thank you very much. I appreciate the tip. I don't really have any other held items that I want to give to people, huh? Hmm. I guess I can give him some berries. <laughs> That's so lazy, though. <laughs> Why would I ever? Any good... What's chilling water do? It's so cold it saps the attack power. It's too deep. What if I sort by... I guess number is going to give me, like, the strongest ones last, right? Terra Blast? Close combat? Yo, Charcuterie can learn close combat? That's pretty badass. I only got one, though. Learned Overheat. I don't want Overheat or Fire Blast because Charcuterie is a physical attacker. Ice Spinner. I, I'm kind of surprised that uh, Little Dripper can't learn Ice Spinner. Uh, we can teach Surf to Dogfish, though. It's 90 attack power. What is What does his other attack do? What do you got? What's your strongest attack right now? Muddy water. Uh, rearrange moves? There we go. Well, that's 90 as well, but it's only 85 accuracy, so I'm pretty sure we teach you Surf. Uh, boxes. No, 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 not boxes. Sorry, 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 sorry. Got confused there for a second. Bag. Wait. Is Dogfish a special attacker or a physical attacker? I have knowledge of Pokemon like an encyclopedia, but I suck at the games. How is that possible, Toads? You are absolutely a special attacker. Okay, good. Drip, you're in the wrong form? I can I mercilessly assault you with cheese when you're in 2D? Well, I mean, there is a throw cheese redeem. You could do that. It is possible. But welcome in, Tips. How you doing today? Did you have a nice, uh, a nice Thanksgiving? It's not the same. It's true. It's not quite the same. Where's my, where's my surf? We're gonna teach this to uh, to dogfish, definitely. There you go. And we're gonna replace muddy water because, I mean, it's cool. It does the does the accuracy thing. Smart when it comes to research, but putting it in action is impossible. Oh, uh, that's valid. That's valid. <laughs> Off tips. I'm glad to hear that you had a good one. Let's see. Heavy slam. Nah, you don't have anything good for that. Shadow Ball. Aura Sphere. I'm like, I'm, I'm looking for anything that might be useful. Anything that might be useful for setup. I'm not really seeing anything. Shadow Claw. Wood Seed. Yeah, no, I think we're, I think we're in pretty good shape. I might want to do Volt Switch on Dollop, actually. Just for utility, you know? It's 70 damage. That's me, Cassiopeia. Uh, we could meet Cassiopeia. Let's do it. Let's go fight Cassiopeia. Please release me. <laughs> Alright, let's go meet Cassiopeia. Who's gonna be our lead? Who's gonna be our lead for Cassiopeia? I think Charcuterie is gonna be. No, let's put Chives in the lead. Now, how do I find Cassiopeia? It's like by the school, right? Get rid of this. Not that. 
The school is like back here, right? Ah, here we go. Starfall Street, Maze of Goza, challenge from Cassiopeia. Set this as my destination. Let's roll. Schoolyard after dark. Is it after dark, by the way? Is it dark yet? Yeah, but like, is it dark yet? Well, the screen is dark. Uh, it's getting dark. Gonna go so I don't want to be spoiled on Cassiopeia's identity. Come on. Yes. You know who she is. Right? Like, it's been clear from the beginning. You know. You gotta know. <laughs> but by all means, yeah, avoid spoilers. <laughs> That's totally fine. I, I do not blame you. But what if it's not? You know, that's true. That's true. I mean, I have my doubts, too. I'm like, they could throw me for a loop, I guess. But I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure I got my uh, my guesses are right. Also, Void, hello! Thank you for the bald. <laughs> Welcome on in. It's good to see you again. It was Drip the whole time? It's true. Uh, it was Drip. It was me. It was me. It was me the whole time. Yeah, I can go behind the school. Mm, no. No, it appears that I can't go behind the school. Yeah, that looks like a... Uh, oh, wait, can I go around it? Oh, there we go. Check that out. Check out them moves. What's that? What's up there? Hold on a minute. What the heck is that? Is this a thing? Oh, frick. <laughs> Never attempted that. Can't ride me right on here. What's on top of there, though? Is that just a decoration? Are they do they all have that? Oh, they all have that. Never mind. Never mind. It's a lightning rod. Oh, I got you. Is this the schoolyard? Is this where I'm supposed to be? This looks like where I'm supposed to be. I guess I have to wait until after dark. I've arrived at my destination. Have to be a lot higher for it to be an effective lightning rod. Eh, it makes a good point. But it does have it's on every one of the towers. They might know if there's a way to pass time in this game. Can we do a picnic? Will picnic pass time? Let's see. Mm, can't host a picnic here. Okay. Hmm. Well, this is where we're supposed to be, but it's not after dark yet. What time is it? It is overcast daytime. It's private property? Yeah, and guess what? I'm trespassing. Be a nice place for a picnic, though? It would be a nice place! Like, why... Why can't I picnic here? Is there any place I can go that I can picnic? I'm back at school. This is the first time I've been back at the school this entire game. You gonna go to class? Absolutely not. I think you're at the back. You need to be in the front. Oh, okay. Let me try to go in the front. Let me try that. <laughs> there we go. Oh, look. It's, it's Clive. <laughs> I think you were right. I think I was getting way too fancy. Hello. Sup, Drip? Director Clavel? It's crime time. Oh, come on. The name's Clive, remember? Actually, no. It's time for me to bring this little performance to an end. Allow me to reveal my true identity. Ah. Oh, is it actually him? Well, no. It's 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 Clavel. <laughs> I do apologize for deceiving you with my disguise. Holy shit, it was Clavel all the time? Whoa! I had no idea. In truth, the boy you knew as Clive was none other than the director of the Uva Academy, Mr. Clavel. <gasps> I'm shocked. I knew him. I, I never knew. I never knew. The real UNO and shit. <laughs> I can't believe he deceived us all. No way. Nate says, do you like gambling? Like, not in real life. <laughs> in video games, it's a fun mechanic, but not in real life. <laughs> Shocked. I didn't see it coming. Nobody saw this coming. Nobody knew. 
<laughs> Let's play some sub roulette. Ooh, sub roulette. This must be quite the shot. What? How, what is? What's sub roulette? Nate <laughs> doesn't he have a dang doctorate. You know that's true. He doesn't have a doctorate. What's? Oh! <laughs> Nate has given a sub to our wonderful Dongo. Yo, thank you so much, Nate. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. <laughs> that's Dongo. Hell yeah. Dongo, there you go. Enjoy, enjoy those emotes. Hell yeah. <laughs> a winner. A winner has been chosen. Good job. <laughs> Nate, thank you so much for the gifted sub. I appreciate you. And, and this must be quite a shock. My disguise was perfect after all, regardless. There's still one more astonishing truth I must reveal to you. Is he going to be the leader of Team Star 2? I'm, uh, yeah, I'm hesitating to move forward. It's true. Sorry. This cheese will spur me on into action. Thank you so much, Trinket. My true identity of Cassiopeia, the big boss of Team Star, is me all along? He's lying, right? That's impossible. Honest to goodness. When you heard Cassiopeia over the phone, that was actually my pre-recorded voice. I pulled it off using one of those high-tech gizmos. Oh, yes, it's very clever. Is he being real? Is he... L okay, so... To be fair, that was one of my theories. I think he's just protecting Cassiopeia. I think, I think you're right. Yeah, it's, it's got, it's, it's Penny though. It's gotta be Penny. I, okay, maybe it is Clavel. I don't know. One thing let's do: face me, final show, and let's decide it all. Let's, do, let's go. I'll fight you. Are you serious? I'm waiting for the twist for him to be like, ah, oh, psych. It really is him, isn't it? Fuck me! Okay, they got me. They got me good. They go also taking out the leader so we can disband him once and for all. Yeah. Cassiopeia of Team Star. With this battle, I'll finally bring Operation Starfall to an end. You could just step down, my dude. Also, these guys are level 60. Uh, um. Yikes. Big yikes. I'm going to terrestrialize right now. Let's go. I'm fighting you, big... I'm fighting you. Let's go. He couldn't have started unless he started when in the 70s? If he's boned? I am a little bit boned. I might be in trouble. <laughs> he's, uh... Huh. Interesting. Like, okay, I thought that, like, maybe he would put them to... Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Don't yawn me. Don't yawn me. Really? All doomed. Do, do I keep my uh, Eevee backpack? Yeah, what about Eevee backpack? What about Penny? Penny is supposed to be Cassiopeia. Pop it. You know what? I here, here we go. I'm calling the new ending. Um, Penny is gonna take over Team Star. Also, Shakuri wants to learn Psycho Cut. I love the person just walking in. Like, <laughs> yeah, they're just like, oh, whatever. Nothing's happening here. Important. It's fine. Whatever. <laughs> What is this game? I know! Oh man, this is so cool. Um, so I guess Psycho Cut would be nice. I kind of like... Okay, so you've got you've got a ghost, you've got a fire. Maybe I get rid of your priority move? For more coverage? Let's get rid of your priority move for more coverage. Making their way downtown, walking fast, faces pass, and they're homebound? Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess I'm going to fall asleep now. Yeah, I'm asleep now. Oh, well. It was bound to happen. I guess I'm going to stay out. Who's he putting it on next? A bomb of snow. Okay, you know what? I probably should have withdrawn. Snow warning. Ew. Can I, uh, can I wake you up? When, when December ends? What does this do? Here are any SAS condition. I mean, I have an awakening, don't I? Yeah, just use an awakening. Now, this guy's probably going to kick my ass because I am pure grass type right now. Excuse me, let me just go straight over the area that you're fighting on. Yeah, exactly. He's like, ah, oh, no, this is fine. This is fine. No veil. Uh, oh, interesting. Okay, sure, fine, whatever. Uh, can I U-turn, mm, though? Mm. I guess I'll play rock. I don't have I don't have any stab now because I'm pure grass. You avoided the attack? Ow. All right. Well, you know what? I deserve that. Fine. Fine. Charcuterie's going to kick your ass. I'm not mad. 
All right, well, this does kind of blow my theory out of the water. That's a little, that's a little strange. I did think that it might be Clive for like the first part of the game, but I was pretty convinced by the end that it was, uh, it was Penny. Do a wood hammer? Get out of here. Get out of here with that. Also, your damage by recoil, so get out. I'm hoping that this is going to, like, keep him healed up. Between the natural, like, drain plus shell bell. Wait, do you not get both? Yeah, there you go. That's not much. That's not much at all. Hmm. Let's see, Gyarados is coming out next. Um, I guess we're going to go for Dollop, even though you are, like, Super duper low health. But you know, I guess I could send out Lil Dripper. Hmm. Good Ice Fang you. I mean, Gyarados is going to be weak against Ice. But it's going to be double weak against Electric. Let's try. Let's try it at least. Up is fucking dead. He's probably going to be super dead. <laughs> Yo, Dongo's got the eyebrows now. Hell yeah. <laughs> got that drip sub from none other than Nate. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right, my attack fell. That's eh, fine. Don't worry about it. Mango Griff subs for subs. <laughs> we love them subs. I guess we can... I think Spark is where we got to go, right? Earthquake. Since when do you have Earthquake, my dude? Damn. Okay, never mind. Dollop is freaking dead. Snow stopped. Um, all right. Aurora Veil. What does the Aurora Veil even do? Let's send out a little dripper. Subs. <laughs> Rip dollop. Poor dollop. Didn't stand a chance. Is little dripper a physical attacker or? Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a special attack. One hedge. Ah damn! Cassiopeia not messing around. Oh yay! Um. Rick, my team's dead. Uh, uh, you, um, Tort? No. I, dogfish? Dogfish, let's go. Ain't gonna do shit. There's a Dom here. Uh, apparently. Apparently. Good God. Damn. This guy... Okay, well, he is level... S oh, God. Okay, yeah, we, we're, we're toast. We're, we're not going to survive this fight. Um, So now we know. Now we know that we have to be in our mid-60s to fight this guy. God damn. Protects users like light screen. Oh, I got you. You're attacking... <laughs> Dango. <laughs> Oh, uh, well, here's my, here's my little, here's my little last ditch effort. I'll fake you out, though. Check this out. Boom, gotcha. Good chip damage. I'll take it. Wow. Yeah, we stand no chance. I can't believe Chives was actually Nimona. <laughs> oh, man. I can't believe that Chives was Fue Coco all along. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Fight the plot twist. We're pop we do be popping. Look at all them pops. Send in those pops. I guess we're gonna shadow claw him to death. We're gonna die. There's no way, there's no way that freaking charcuterie carries this. Absolutely no way in hell. Because I guarantee you. I guarantee you this guy has like a uh a Terra Pokemon at the end, right? Is that Ray? Ray! Welcome on in! Hello! How you doing today? You know what? Everybody's getting shoutouts today, by the way. Ray is an amazing streamer, by the way. A fellow real internet animal. Go get Oh, you got that new uh got that new badge art in there. Hell yeah, I love it. Go give him a follow. Trust me. You are going to love what you see in there. Ray here just in time for the end. <laughs> Uh, Ray, Ray is here just in time to see Drip Pop floating across the endless void in the, uh, in the, the sphere of mysteries. 
the, the the orb knows the orb knows that I got my butt handed to me. Yin, hell yeah! Shout out these nuts. Got him. Got him. You did got him. True, you did got him. So I've decided that uh, we can't fight Cassiopeia. Is that a ladder? Is that a ladder? Can I climb up this? <gasps> Hold on, I gotta see what's up here. <laughs> I gotta see what's up here. And, and antlers, by the way. Swords? This isn't sword and shield. What are you doing? Dang it, you put the wrong ones on here. Yeah, we were way too underleveled. I think we gotta be like mid-60s to take that guy on. Okay. I've done it. I'm up here now. Oh! I see something down here. I'm bald? No, I got swords on. It's fine. I'm not bald. Hm. Swords be a sword dance? Yo, electro ball? I there's more things up here. Is there more stuff up here that I can get? You think? Ah, oh, there's an item up there. I do love how I just got my little motorcycle. <laughs> I'm just like, I'm gonna drive all over the city, it's fine. Any other items? No. Okay, so I find myself in a need to do a little bit of level. I find myself needing to level up a bit and get strong. Oh, oh, hang on, there's an item here. No, I want to climb the building. Let me climb the building, please. I want to climb the building! Can I climb the building? It's not going to let me climb the building, is it? Wow. This rooftop parkour, this game's nuts? I know. D D these, these, this game is these, these nuts. Got, got him? Am I... Did I do it right? Did I do a good job? Put another ladder? Yeah. I think I'm going to find another ladder. I can probably get on this roof. Nope. Nope. Yes. Yes. No. No. Yes. Maybe. No. Yes. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. We're good. We're good. We got it. We got it. We got it. There. There's always a way to. There's always a way to hack it. Did you get Clavel? I uh, I got my butt kicked by Clavel. <laughs> I got I got absolutely smashed by Clavel. I got my butt. Absolutely handed to me by Clavel. She was like, "Hey, get get." It was it was not a good time. So they meet Whippy Deer in less than a week. Oh my gosh, Ray! I'm so looking forward to it. I'm gonna I'm gonna get all the hugs from you. It's true. True stories. True stories, and I won't accept no for an answer. <laughs> so looking forward to it. It's gonna be such an absolute blast. Um, let me see. Give me the uppies. <gasps> Real live uppies. What the hell's on the roof here? What is that? Hello? You too? What? Sir? What is this guy? Skyrim that shit? Yeah, exactly. It's a whole design to the roof chops. I wish I tried getting up here earlier. What is this guy? Are you like stuck, sir? Are you trapped up here? Are you also the type that likes to chill out on rooftops? Well, make sure you don't fall off. I don't need to fall off. I got... Got a flying motorcycle? I need to worry about that. Ah, frick, you got me. You know what? I am bald. True. <laughs> Yo, Whoopals! Hello! Welcome on in! Oh my goodness, thank you for the raid. Hello, hello. Raiders, it's so good to see you here. I am flying off of rooftops in the middle of uh, Pokemon. <laughs> Whoopals? Whoopals the bottom waffle wants to battle? Oh my gosh, yes. I do want to battle a Whoople. I do want to battle a waffle. I love it. Hold on, let me give a little shout out for our wonderful Wuffles the Waffler. Hey, Drip Pop, can you come here for a second? Show all these wonderful people who Wuffles the Waffler is. That's him right there. A real live internet animal. Look at him go. Everybody give him a follow. Wuffles has the most beautiful Scottish accent that you will ever find on Twitch. Just saying, you you want to be there. You want to be in that place. Undead Zombie Panda, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Hello, hello. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love it. Wait, wait, Wuffles the top waffle? Wait, hold on, Wuffles. I need you to, which one are you? Are, are you the top waffle or the bottom waffle? I'm building a waffle stack and I need to know. For structural integrity purposes. 
<laughs> oh, Undead Zombie Panda. I'm, I'm doing really well. I'm having an absolute blast right now. Uh, we are pretty much at the point of the game where we've completed all the storylines. So, hold on, let me just uh, get off this real quick. Don't you, don't you give me those eyebrows, Wuffles. You answer the question, damn it. 